Hello, everyone, and welcome to Mulligan's Island on Monday night. It's a special Monday because it is Memorial Day, and uh, we are grateful for our freedom, grateful to all the folks who gave their lives in giving that to us, and hope everybody was able to celebrate this weekend. Have a good long weekend, and I'm happy that you're going to be with us to close it out today. Uh, we got a studio audience here, and Pablo, do you want to put a microphone to them? No? Yes. All right. Uh, anyway, uh, it's a beautiful day here in Mexico where we're coming to you from, just around the corner from San Carlos in an uh, area called Miramar, my backyard bar. Tonight you can pull up a virtual bar stool, pour yourself something to drink out there, let your friends know about this, because this is going to be kind of fun as we have a special guest joining us tonight. He's sitting right out there, and he's going to pop up here in a little while and join me. His name is Sam Rainwater. Everybody give it up for Sammy. It's going to be fun. He's got a zookalele, and that always means a good time. You're going to hear some of Sam's music, some of my music. We've got some videos. We've got pictures. It's a three-ring circus around here. We've got my son, Luis, handling your incoming comments and requests. And I sure would appreciate it if you would share this on your page or if you would even just let some friends know to flip on over here to Mulligan's Island on Facebook and, uh, and join us for the next hour, hour and a half. Okay? Uh, cool stuff coming up today, but I'll tell you what, we kick things off every week with a theme song written and performed by our buddy who's on vacation right now having a great time. His name is Rudy B. Take it away, Rudy B. Mexico, where we can meet the friends we know. White sand, warm sun, and H2O. It's time for us to get back to laid back. Try a different beer from our favorite six pack. This crazy world says, come on, let's go. It's time for the music man. Coastal kid with guitar in hand Even bad days are good Here on the island Giving us a place where we can Talk to each other fan to fan Uncharted courses crossing our paths It's our kind of people And our kind of place Down in the tropics It's a Mexican hideaway Life in this old beach town Turns a frown upside down We all be smiling Here on Mulligan's Island It's the right place and the right time To be south of the border again This is the day we get to listen in We don't sing no blues anymore We kick off our shoes at our front door Full of wide-eyed wonder as the waves roll in It's time for the music man A coastal kid with guitar in hand Even bad days are good here on the island Giving us a place where we can Talk to each other fan to fan Uncharted courses crossing our paths It's our kind of people And our kind of place Down in the tropics A Mexican hideaway Life in this old beach town Turns a frown upside down We all be smiling Here on Mulligan's Island We 
y'all be smiling here on Mulligan's Island. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Mulligan's Island. I am excited about tonight because next to me is Empty Barstool that in just a couple of songs, my buddy Sam Rainwater will be seated right there playing happy songs on an ukulele. So get ready for some fun. You know, here in Mexico, where we are, it is a beautiful day, blue sunny skies, it's warm out. But you know, further to the south of us, they've been getting hit by a big hurricane today, down where Sammy just came from, down in Puerto Escondido in that whole area. So those nasty hurricanes come around, we're gonna sing about them right now. Beaches and blue skies. Then came the hurricane and bye bye paradise. Now his roof somewhere in Florida, his fridge floated out to sea. His pickup truck is stuck in muck, his boat's up in a tree. Old John was last seen out on the dock, screaming out to the weather gods, Is that all you got? From the Florida Keys down in Belize to Bahamas to Mexico We all want to be where the hurricanes blow Except when the hurricanes blow Now Tom and PJ bought a boat and named that baby conk out God knows that's how they felt before they ever left the dock when Francis and the Jean blew the wind right out of their sails Torn and tattered, dazed and battered, thinking man let's bail Last time I heard from Captain Tom He was anchored somewhere beautiful, pouring PJ a shot of rum No doubt they got conked out, but they kept that dream afloat They just want to be where the hurricanes blow Except when the hurricanes blow. Newsflash, the highway's packed. They've gotten out while they can. Now it's too late to evacuate and it's about to hit the fan So I'm stocked up on Captain Morgan Breaking out my snorkel and fins Shaking, mass breaking, here we go again I'm writing my will for the umpteenth time And making one last toast from the coast So lift those glasses high Here's to John, PJ, and Tom, and all of you crazy folks Who just want to be where the hurricanes blow We all come cause we love the sun, but there's one thing you gotta know We all want to be where the hurricanes blow Except when the hurricanes blow Except when the hurricanes blow Except when the hurricanes blow, Except when the hurricanes blow. Except when the hurricane blows. <laughs> you know, that might have been the wrong song to start with, with Buck and Trina, who just bought a house down here and moved down here full time. It's not like that all the time here, guys, I promise. Okay? Every, every couple of months. That's it. Anyway. Hey, I'm excited to get Sam up here in just a few minutes. Sam Rainwater fans out there, be sure to let us know what you would like to hear from him tonight. He's got that ukulele, and it's going to be fun. But, hey, speaking of fun, we had a special weekend here in the Mulligan family. Uh, little Mighty Soul's not home right now, but we're so proud of her. She made her first communion at the church right down the street here. We walked over there, and there she is. She was uh, excited. You guys saw that last weekend, you know, before doing the first communion. We, we make a first confession. And she did her confession last uh, time we did a show here. It was on Tuesday. On Monday, I'm sorry. And she was nervous about that confession. Let me tell you, I'm kind of wondering what she's been up to. 
But anyway, uh, it was a special thing. Congratulations to Marisol. We went down to Navajo and we celebrated with her cousin who also made her first communion uh, on that very same day. And there she is right there, daddy's little girl. So congratulations, felicidades to Marisol. We may see her later on on the show. But for right now, I'm going to sing a song all about that little kid you just saw. We got more folks showing up in our studio audience. Hi, guys. Up yourself to a chair and a drink. Mar means ocean. Soul means sun. Just in case you're wondering where her name came from. I never thought anything in life could ever be as beautiful as sea and sun together. At least until the day she came along. Now, oh, 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 oh I love my little Marty. of my world Oh, 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 oh I love my little naughty soul Oh, 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 oh She's just her daddy's girl Sure, I love my sons And roughhouse and fun but there are things that only daughters do Now that pink dress and those little shoes are matching I can't believe she's already into fashion She's gonna break a heart or two Now, oh, 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 oh I love my little Daddy's girl, she's growing up too fast, and each day she's prettier than the one before. I don't want to think about the day some kid comes knocking on my door. Singing, oh, 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 oh I love your daughter, Marty Soul. Anything in this world Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa He'll be in love with mighty soul Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa She'll still be daddy's girl She'll always be her daddy's girl I love my little mind so. Felicidades a Marisol. Congratulations to my little girl. All right, well, she's not the only girl in this family who's been up to some fun things. Elsa, as you guys know, and you probably saw this on Facebook, just did something very cool up the coast. And rather than me spoil the whole thing for you, why don't we head up the coast to Kino Bay two hours from here and check in with Elsa and see what she's up to up there. Hi, this is Elsa, and we are in Tonina's Beach in Kino Bay. And today we're going to swim. We are in a completion. We're going to swim from that island called Alcatraz from there to here, to the beach. So it's going to be fun. I haven't trained at all. And let's see what happens.
guys caught me pouring a drink. Imagine that. Hey, welcome back. How about that? Everybody give Elsa a round of applause. Pretty impressive swimming that mile from Alcatraz Island, Pelican Island in Kino, all the way to the beach. Uh, what a cool video. Man, a lot of participants. And there are a other San Carlos folks that were in this, like Susan Cook, Susan Dawson Cook, your Bahia Delphine resident. She was up there, Sam, in that, uh, in that race, too. Um, and some of my Kino Bay friends did great. One of my friends, Terry Overcast, she won the uh, over 75 category. She won the medal. Now, I must tell you, she was the only participant in her age group. But she still did great. Give her a round of applause. Anyway, hey, look who just crashed the stage. Sammy Rainwater. Welcome to Mulligan's Island. Hey, everybody. How y'all doing out there? <laughs> so, Sammy, what have you been up to? Well, you know, just uh, this, that, and the other thing. I've been working on the new boat I just bought most of the week. Okay. But before we get any further, I uh, want to just raise a toast to everybody out there, to all of our veterans, those that are still with us and those that aren't. And thank you all for your service. Cheers. 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 Salud. Well done, Sammy. All right. Well, you got an ukulele in your hands. Yeah, I got an ukulele. All right. Let's see, let's see what you got for us. Okay. Here. Well, we we got a request in for a little uh, local song. It's about the potholes up on Ranchitos Road up in the <laughs> Ranchitos. They are nasty. Ranchitos Road. Ranchitos Road. The roadway from hell ain't meant for heavy loads. No one claims to own them. You are on your own. If you drive too fast, your tires may explode. Ranchitos Road. Ranchitos Road. Full of potholes You don't need speed bumps To slow you as you go You weave to go around them But deeper they grow There's no way around The potholes Ranchitos Road Ranchitos Road Ranchitos Road Ranchitos Road A roadway from hell Ain't meant for heavy loads No one claims to own them You are on your own If you drive too fast your tires may explode Ranchitos Road So I asked the local policy Why not fix the hole They said they like it this way They just look down the road If you weep between the holes You're sober, they can't see but if you're driving straight, drunk ass you must be. <laughs> Ranchitos Road. Ranchitos Road. Ranchitos Road. A roadway from hell ain't meant for heavy loads. Ranchitos Road You gotta weave, weave, weave Weave between the holes You gotta drive it to get home Ranchitos Road You gotta weave, weave, weave You gotta weave between the holes Gotta drive it to get home, Ranchitos Road. And when they'll 
fix it Only Jesus knows Jesus is the guy who fixes it up there all the time The Ranchitos Road The Ranchitos Road A road way from hell Ain't meant for heavy loads No one claims to own it You are on your own If you drive too fast Your tires may explode Ranchitos Road Ranchitos Road Ranchitos Road Ranchitos Road By the way, there's a tire repair at both ends. <laughs> <laughs> you folks in San Carlos know what he's talking about. That is that is actually in better shape now, but for a long time, that was in, nearly impassable. Yeah, you know, as, as soon as I wrote that song, they fixed it. But <laughs> there, there's still one section that's pretty bad, so uh, I can still, uh, it's still. In fact, you know, the Miramar Road, you know, coming I mean, uh, B- 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 oh yeah, yeah, that road. That's looking pretty bad. Getting over this way, if well, you're coming this way. Well, yeah. Sa- Sam's trying to keep a song alive. I saw him out there with a hoe, getting holes in that road again, digging yeah. them up again. Oh yeah, so. right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, anyway, welcome Sam Rainwater. It's great to have you here on Mulligan's Island. Uh, this is great I to be think, back, Mark. I think your third time on the show now. Yeah, maybe. So, Something like that, yeah. Welcome. Let's sing a song about this awesome place we are okay. called Mexico. Two, three, four. <laughs> Coming across that border line tonight And I can feel the touch of a young girl Gently take my hand beneath the moonlight Soft of brains on a Spanish guitar Carry me away A voice is calling as I close my eyes Think I hear her say, Mexico And I just can't stay away, Mexico Like warm white sand in the fall, but my head gotta go Mexico It's been a while, but does she remember? Is she still waiting there for me? old roads, you got me crossing the line, take me down to where nobody knows, take me back in time, Mexico, you're the one that I love and I can't get enough, Mexico, but you're another world away, Mexico, those clear blue skies and big brown eyes gotta go. Mexico. I can feel that wind begin to blow. Every time I hear that sound, I know Mexico. You've been there on my mind for a long, long time, and I know that I just can't stay away. But my hand gotta go And I'll be coming back to you stay Mexico You're the one that I love And I can't get enough Mexico But you're another world away Mexico Those clear blue skies And big brown eyes gotta go Mexico Bad 
place to hang out, is it, Sammy? Not a bad place at all. <laughs> all right. Thank you guys very much. I love this studio audience, by the way. Yeah. They, they brought me booze and pizza. That's really good stuff. Man. You guys want to move in? Yeah. We got yeah. room for you. Yeah. I might share in a bed with all the kids and us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, Sammy, what do you got for us? Well, um, you going to do Tetakali? Yeah, let's do Tetakali. Yeah. I'm going to actually, uh, right here it is. Just a, my biggest problem is trying to remember what key I'm playing in. So, <laughs> little song about a mountain we got over here. Sort of a landmark for for San Carlos. Tedakawi, 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 Tedakawi. Tedakawi in the moonlight, guacamole in a bowl, margaritas made with moonshine, a slice of lime and a nice cold soul. Dodging horses, cows, and chickens as we're headed on a mission to be having a real good time on a starry San Carlos night, fiesta time, Tedakawi. Tedakawi, Tedakawi, Tedakawi in the daytime. Headed out to sea. Catch some dinner for our dinner. Fish is for our dinner. Get the captain's tube. Fillet them for you and me. I'm chilling on a noodle and martini coke. Sipping sangria wine. On a sunny San Carlos day. So sublime. I avoid karaoke at the local bars. It's really no longer my thing. That's until I had a little bit too much to drink. And all I want to do is sing, sing, sing. Tedakawi, Tedakawi. So at this point in the song, I like to do a little sing along. It's a song everybody knows, so I'm sure you want to sing along with me. Here we go. We were sailing along on Moonlight Bay. I could hear the voices singing. They seem to say, they seem to say, you have stolen my heart. So don't go away. As we sail through the moonlight on Moonlight Bay near Tedakawi, 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 Tedakawi. Sitting on the seawall late in the day, you can hear me play my ukulele. Why don't you all come over? As the sun goes down, we all can sing, 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 sing. Full moon party at the beach. Then the band takes the stage. Dancing music till the moonshine is gone. Skinny dipping in the ocean is quite the rage. Sooner or later, gotta head back home. Get some sleep before the sun goes down. So we can get in and do it again. San Carlos bound. I'm San Carlos bound. I'm San Carlos bound. Paradise found. Tedakawi. 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 Yeah. There we go. Nice. Yeah. And that was kind of cool seeing some pictures of Tetakawi uh, there. By the way, these pictures right. that uh, some of them are pictures that Elsa and I took, but a bunch of those are pictures you guys took. Some nice ones of Tetakawi. And by the way, I just had a video sent to me by a couple of friends here, uh, Jeff Lane and Gina. I want to thank you guys for this video of their. Uh, uh, they sent a a shot of Tetakawi. Yep. We got to follow up that song with this video. If you wonder what he's talking about. Check this out, sent to, you, sent to us by Jeff and Gina Laney.
Petakawi is like our defining landmark here in San Carlos. And if you've never had a chance to hike up it, wow, what a view as you can see from the top. I don't know if you can see Jeff and Gina. They were actually there waving to the camera from below. What amazing views. And as you drive in the town into San Carlos and you see Tetakawi in front of you, you know that you're home again in San Carlos. Anyway, somebody who I know is missing being here a little bit watching us up in Canada sent me a request early uh, today because for the last two weeks in a row, she's been stymied. For some reason, Luis has vetoed her. I don't think he knew that she was requesting a song. Well, this is what uh, Cheryl Howell and, and uh, Bill Thompson wanted to hear up there in Canada. Hope you guys are doing well. This one goes out for you. The old man drank a beer every now and then. One day we cracked a couple, just me and him. At 80 years old, all the stories he could tell you about his far flung friends from France to Venezuela. He said, I swig Fosters with Aussies and Guinness in an Irish pub. A Shiner Bach and Looking Bach. Buddy, sure enough, it's all a same beer, different can. Just different labels, different brands. But the more you sit, the more you understand. It's all a same beer, different can. Our pal Tom Shepard played a tour overseas Singing for all our folks Stationed in the Middle East At the Ambassador's home right there in Riyadh He sang a special song he'd written about his dad And when the show was over he was loading up his van this guy walked up to Tom and stuck out his hand He said that song about your father Really meant a lot to me Cause I just lost mine and you described him perfectly Now that man had on a white robe He wore sandals on his feet He had a gutra on his head And man it ain't that hard to see We're all the same beer, different can Just different labels, different brands But the more you sip, the more you understand We're all the same beer, different can said, I believe God's gonna get a good laugh when we learn all of us buds and millers and land sharks and coors and yeah guys, even Pabst are all the same beer, different can. Just different labels, different brands. But the more you sit, the more you Understand, we're all the same beer, different can. The more you sip, the more you understand. We're all the same beer, different can. Thank you very much. Thanks, Tom Shepard, for singing that one with me, for co-writing that song, but doing it together as a duet, as a title track on that album. Hey, San Carlos friends out there, we're going to make you hungry. Now, we're going to a spot that actually quite a few San Carlos folks have never even been to, even though it's right past us, a little bit northwest. The village of La Manga is a fishing village. Um, from my house here, it would be about maybe 30 minutes. 
But uh, from the end of the road in, in San Carlos out by Soggy Peso, it's just another mile or, or so. But it's a different world from San Carlos. It's a, it's a fishing village, an authentic fishing village. And I'll tell you, you want to get some great seafood, we're taking you right now to a place. I'm going to show you a place next time you're visiting here. You got to take a chance on this place. Let's go out to La Manga Fishing Village and a restaurant called Doña Rosita. <laughs> I am sitting in one of my favorite seafood restaurants in the world. I'm just a few minutes northwest of San Carlos in the fishing village of La Manga at a restaurant called Doña Rosita. Well, I know what I'm gonna have, the house specialty, Boca Gente Caliente. Well, they got me working in the kitchen here. I'm going to be uh, preparing my mocha hippie over here. Putting in octopus, shrimp, and caracol, which is snail. Well, this lava bowl you see right here, this is the mocha hippie. And what I'm going to do is put in a spoonful of this salsa española. Spanish sauce. Now, put in the good stuff. All right. Get some cheese on it now. Top it off. Cilantro. And avocado. It is looking good. And here we go with some mushrooms. And I think we have ourselves a mocha hit the caliente. Now one thing you've got to do when you come to Doña Rosita You've got to order the clams. They're different here than most seafood places. You're going to see what I'm talking about in just a second. See, they serve these live. They actually have a uh, water tank down there uh, below, and they, they uh, send the water up here. They've got oxygen tanks up here in the kitchen, and they keep their queen clams, their chocolatas, and their oysters alive with the oxygen of the water tanks daily. Look at that. That is a fresh clam. Now the molca gente caliente is the specialty of the house here at Doña Rosita. It is excellent. Uh, like you saw before, this has got octopus, it's got shrimp, it's got uh, snail, caracol, it's got mushroom, avocado, cheese, and a Spanish sauce. And they serve it really, really hot. And mm, what flavor. It's incredible. Well, meanwhile, Elsa is going to have the stuffed flounder, and it looks really good. Uh, so this has got um, octopus, and it's got shrimp, and it's got melted cheese on the top, and a bechamel sauce. And it looks really good. Elsa, give it a shot for us. What do you think? I love it. <laughs> Recommendation from Elsa. Really good food here, guys. This is Alexis here. He came to our table and he brought with him a queen clam, a reina, and he's going to prepare it for us. After cleaning it out, taking it out of the shell, he's going to add in tomatoes and onions and cilantro and garlic, along with octopus and some shrimp. Clamato. This is already looking good, isn't it, folks? And now you got the tomato, the cilantro, the onion. Okay. And some celery. And this is salsa cachoriana. Okay. 
kind of a spicy sauce they've got down here. Ooh, look at that. And we got ourselves a prepared queen clam. Looking really good. Can't wait to dig into this. You know what I really like about Lomanga? is you're just a few minutes northwest of San Carlos, but you've really got an authentic Mexican fishing village experience here. Um, the food is incredible. They've always got a, a great crowd here. They've got live music playing here, bands roaming around. Um, but, you know, how about the view? You just can't beat the view in a place like this. Well, I'm with Omar. He is the manager here at La Manga Doña Rosita. Omar, what a great place. Gracias. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. How long has this been here? This has been open since 2001. Okay. Okay. When it first opened, the name was a Mirador de la Manga. Okay. That was officially in 2005. Okay. Now in 2009, that's when it changed its name to Doña Rosita. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Well, you guys are sure a big hit here in the community. Yes. Uh, on Saturdays and Sundays, it's a, it's a wait to get into these places. Yes, it days. is. Yes, so, it is. yeah. Uh, what What's everybody's favorite dish here? Do you think? Well, we have a little bit of everything. My favorite and that I want, the one that I recommend always is the grilled fish. Okay. The grilled fish is something that we always bring in our own panga, so it's fresh. Yeah. We don't buy the fish, we go fish it ourselves. Awesome. Okay, the restaurant has four pangas, okay, so we have our own fishermen. Yeah. Another thing that I recommend that is fresh and we keep them alive is our oysters and our clams. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's excellent. Boy, you can really note the freshness of the food here. It really sets you guys apart. So when you guys are visiting San Carlos, make sure that you come out here to the fishing village of La Manga. Come all the way to the very end as you parallel the coast. Go up the hill a little bit. You'll see the restaurant right there on the water. Make sure you uh, hook up with Omar here. He'll make sure you have the great food and great drinks, and you'll have an awesome time here at Doña Rosita. Thank you, Thank Omar. Thank you so much. Thank you. It is an incredible spot, guys, as every one of my studio audience can, can vouch for uh, out in La Manga. Next time you're in San Carlos, you got to visit. I think that video made my friend Sandy over in Florida uh, hungry because we got a request from her for this song. We got a whole bunch of requests. We're going to try to get to all these guys. Going out for Sandy. Everyone says, I'm so lucky. I got the best wife in the world. But I can't lie. There's been this girl Every time we get together I lose all self-control She satisfies my needs Like no one else I know We meet down on the south side In a drugstore parking lot She always keeps it spicy Cause she knows I like it hot She enables my addiction it's sinful, I confess How I give in to temptation But I can't resist Lupita, Lupita's taco stand Best food this side of Rio Grande When she asks you, quieres otro? Just smile and say si the best six bucks a guy could ever spend Is at Lupita's Lupita's Taco Stand Now if you're into real fine dining Or hanging out with snobs Or waiters in tuxedos No, this ain't your kind of spot It's just plastic chairs and tables Foam cups and paper plates But the food Lupita serves you Will leave a big smile on your face There's no list of healthy options No low fat or gluten free Good luck keeping count if you're counting calories It's a flavorful fiesta Of chicken, pork or beef with a heap inside of Spanish rice and a smack of refried beans. And Lupita, Lupita's taco stand. It's heaven in a fresh tortilla made by hand. The salsa's hot and spicy. 
your taste buds say ole. Guaranteed your waistline will expand. Down at Lupita's, Lupita's Taco Stand. Now my wife's home making meatloaf. I ought to be ashamed as I'm slapping on the salsa and the guacamole. Now most folks wouldn't set foot here or ever hit this side of town. The buildings they see better days, the neighborhoods run down. But if you feel a bit adventurous, you'll be glad you took the chance. Believe me, I guarantee you'll come back again to Lupita, Lupita's taco stand. Just one bite and you're bound to comprehend You'll be shouting hallelujah And viva Mexico You're gonna stuff your face there Every chance you get Down at Lupita's Lupita's taco stand Come on, help me out guys Down at Lupita's Lupita's taco stand Where are we going after the show tonight? Down to Lupita's, Lupita's Taco Stand. <laughs> on that note, let's call back up to the stage our buddy Sammy Rainwater. Come on back, Sammy. All right. Great to have everyone with us tonight. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for sharing this on your Facebook page and uh, even just letting other people know about it. The more the merrier. We always love to get some new faces watching this show so all right well see it's been in the sun Stole yeah, yeah, right. that, that's good welcome back sammy yeah. thank you mark <laughs> so uh i guess i got a song Now, lots of jokes about trailer trash. Pink flamingos on the lawn. Big red three written on the side. Dead cars on the lawn. When someone says that they have one, it makes you stop and blink. But where that trailer's parked is more important than you think. Cause it's okay to have a trailer down in Mexico. Especially when it's down by the sea. It's okay to watch your pesos, living frugal's not a sin. We just wish that there was room for us to move on in. Now little shacks down by the sea have always had appeal. But living without services is really a big deal. Aluminum enclosures are truly an upgrade. With frozen drinks and indoor plumbing, you know you got it made. It's okay to have a trailer down in Mexico, especially when it's down by the sea. It's okay to watch your pesos, and frugal's not a sin. We just wish that there was room for us to move on in. When it's locales down here Up north tornadoes search them out Down here no need to fear It may not last forever But hey what us does The bucks you save means you can Spend more on the things you love You know Buffett wrote that he was glad He didn't live in one That sailor's son was talking about The keys they're overrun if he saw how they looked down here, I think he'd change his rhyme. 
and rewrite last last first to say down here they're just fine it's okay to have a trailer down in mexico especially when it's down by the sea it's okay to watch your pesos living frugal's not a sin we just wish that there was room for us to move on in when you're living by the ocean any place is a win-win yeah. there we go yeah <laughs> i know somebody who lives in a trailer down in mexico and actually actually uh is watching us tonight with a group of Ooh. friends oh yeah at our friend Charlie and Claudia's house, yes, watching with right. Bud and, and uh, Kathy and some other folks. I want to say hello to hey Sherry guys. Kaiser, who uh, she's kind of the, lives the video to that song right there. Yep. And first thing we got to do is celebrate her birthday with her. What do you think, guys? Happy birthday to Sherry Kaiser. Yes. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. are watching us from Charlie's Third World Cantina. It's great to have you here with us, Sherry. Wishing you a happy birthday. And you know what? I appreciate the request for this song here. Uh, but I'll tell you what. Before I sing the song, I think we need to show these people something. Let's, uh, let's go up to Rocky Point right now, up to Sherry's place. <clears throat> Rocky Point with my friend Sherry Kaiser. Hi, Sherry. Hey there, how are you? Sherry, I'm curious, what is your favorite Mark Mulligan song? Mm, let me see. Could it be this one? How about this, folks? <laughs> like this. You gotta love this, this. one. <laughs> I now feel like a rock star. Yeah. And he signed it for me today. Thank That's you. Right. Yeah. Pretty cool. I will do this for your house. Yeah. <laughs> Sherry, you have officially made me feel like a rock star by doing that. Happy birthday to you, and this song goes out for you. Got a constant craving. I can't fight the urge. Try to kick the habit, but it keeps on getting worse. I've given up on rehab. It's far too late. This lifelong addiction is impossible to break. Give me some white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. You know what? This intervention's useless. It's out of my control. Twelve steps from the ocean. Who needs twelve more? When you got white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. White sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Oh! Now it goes back to my childhood, that very first trip. Watching the waves roll in, mesmerized this kid. By the time they dragged me up the beach and shoved me in the car, I knew no matter where I'd go, I'd never get too far. From white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Living by the sea is so good for the soul. I pinch myself and wonder who could ask for more than white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. White sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Oh! Who is that little kid in those pictures? Send me a postcard with pictures of the 
the snow I'll look at it and shiver And just shake my head As I'm putting on my flip-flops And stepping out instead Into the white sand the warm sun And salty H2O Take all your sweaters and set them on fire. Slap on some sunscreen, put on some Kelly Maguire. Then turn around and run right to the place you ought to be. Get your butt to some beach chair down here with me. In white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. Living by the sea is so good for the soul. I pinch myself and wonder who could ask for more than white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. There's no cure for this addiction. Every day I overdose on white sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. White sand, warm sun, and salty H2O. birthday to Sherry. I love that trailer. Let's get Sammy Rainwater back up here. Sammy, come join us again. Great to have all you guys with us. We got some more requests coming up. Sam, I think you've got some requests too. You got Lucky Me for Patty yeah, Duncan. Lucky, uh, for, uh, Patty, right? Yeah, Sam's yeah. got, he's got his fans watching tonight too. Thank you very much. I also think uh, my uh, daughter may be watching from our condo back in uh, Bahia Delphine. Oh, nice. Uh, with her, uh, with the kids and uh, her friends and all that sort of thing. So, uh, I was going to do a song. You better not mess up. I was, I was going to do a song for Claudia because I know it's her favorite oh, yeah, song. Yeah. I can do that. Then we'll go to requests. How's that sound? You got it. Okay. Hi, Claudia. Hi, Jerry. <laughs> so, uh, Claudia likes this song as her and uh, Charlie were both the teachers during their career. And, um, this song was inspired by my daughter telling me that she was afraid to take the little kids out of school for a week, that they'd lose too much while they were gone. I'm like, you know, they're going to learn so much more just being at the beach and enjoying themselves. And it's a different side of things that you learn here. And so uh, that was the inspiration for the song. Anyway. Dogs chase seabirds in the sun They think they're gonna catch one Jump and try to catch them by surprise But the birds, they stay just out of reach just out of reach Just out of reach Some things in life you learn But in school they never teach Just out of reach Just out of reach Things you can learn down at the beach This beautiful girl picks up this crusty old shell As she strolls down the beach This crusty old man tries to pick up on that girl But the girl, she stays 
just out of reach just out of reach just out of reach some things in life you learn but in school they never teach just out of reach just out of reach the things you can learn down at the beach things in our lives we try to achieve and sometimes can't see out of reach but surrounded by those that we love what more could you want what more you need Sailing on the sea A westerly course on a downwind reach A green flash ahead as the sun goes down And the sky in color screams As the day slips out of reach just out of reach Just out of reach There's Some things in life you learn But in school you never teach So just out of reach Just out of reach Things you can learn In school they never teach that I've learned down at the beach. Oh, thank you. Nice job. Thanks, so, everybody. So that's one of that's one of Claudia. Uh, favorite songs. I think yeah. I think we ought to introduce people to yeah. Charlie and Claudia. They met him on the show a few months ago, but a lot of people uh, maybe didn't see that. So let's meet Charlie and Claudia. We're hosting this little watching party. There's two watching parties actually going on in Rocky Point tonight. Oh, great. Margarita Mermaids. I want to say hi Woo! to everybody watching the bar there because they, they get folks in there. They give them drink specials and they put a tip jar out there and all the tip money goes to local charity there in Rocky Point when we do this. So hi to all you guys watching the bar. Hi, Rene. Hi, Leti, Alfredo, Jesus, and the whole staff there, too. Um, and then, the, of course, we got a watch party going on over at Charlie's Third World Cantina uh -huh. uh, with a bunch of folks. So let's meet this host of the party, Charlie and Claudia, right now up in Rocky Point. Well, you guys have seen their names many times on my show. I'd like to introduce you to Charlie and Claudia LeClaire. Hi, Charlie and Claudia. Hi, Mark. Hi, Mark. Boy, we are in beautiful Rocky Point right now where you guys live. What what brought you down here? Well, we first got to Tucson to go to school. And, of course, from South Florida, we said, where is the nearest beach? Yeah. They pointed us to Rocky Point. It was in 1973, and we've been coming ever since. Very cool. Claudia, what's your favorite thing about Rocky Point? My favorite thing about Rocky Point? What do you think? Oh, I love the seafood here. Do you? Absolutely. Yeah. Charlie, how about you? Well, of course, being a golfer, today we have fabulous golf. But back then we didn't. Yeah. But it was beach and wonderful people, great restaurants, maybe the little cantinas. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think you picked a pretty cool spot if you ask me, guys. Good decision. So, Charlie, tell us about your neighborhood here in Rocky Point. Well, this is Los Conchas. It's the original, uh, primarily American neighborhood, about seven miles of, of beautiful beaches, as you can see. 
Uh, today we have about uh, 60 houses, uh, 600 houses, and it's just a gorgeous neighborhood to, to live in. Yeah. So how long have you lived here? We've lived here uh, almost 40 years. Okay. And that's kind of amazing. We bought the worst place in the best neighborhood. Yeah. And today we still have. And Los Conchas place. was a lot different back then. Yeah, today we still have the worst place in the best neighborhood, but we're <laughs> a little better. Yeah. But it's a beautiful place to live. Yeah, it certainly is. Uh, this beach just seems to stretch on forever. And uh, about how many miles until you hit the estuary down there, Chuck? About, it's about six and a half miles. And at the end is a beautiful estuary that's available to us. And we take jeeps down there. We have parties down there. Beautiful place. Yeah. Well, you sure have a beautiful neighborhood here, Charlie. Yes. Las Conchas. So I hear there's been big news in the LeClaire family. You bet. We just welcomed the newest Mulligan Hooligan, Max. Awesome. New grandson. I like it. We, I think we need his demographic, don't we? <laughs> you know, Mark, <clears throat> this is a great place to go walk in and sell. At least three, four times a week, I'm out here and walk two, three, four miles, and it's a wonderful, wonderful opportunity. Boy, it is a perfect beach to go for a nice long walk. Yep, I would say Charlie and Claudia have got a pretty sweet deal. All right, guys. Well, welcome back. Welcome back, Charlie and Claudia. So glad you guys are with us tonight. Uh, what a what a family the Leclairs are. I wish you guys could all meet them in person because you'd have a blast with these guys. So uh, anyway, I got a request. This one's going up to Ontario, a uh, loyal supporter of this show, Tom Copeland, watching with Eleanor and Ellie tonight. I'm sure. Uh, Tom, you'll always like to go into the archives. He likes to challenge me, and I like that, Tom. Uh, he doesn't throw me softball, so he makes he gets me on my toes like he's doing with this request right here. Goes back to my very second album. It's the title track. That was second album out of 16 albums. So I had brown hair back then. This was a cassette tape. People are in shock that I once had brown hair. Uh, but anyway, this is the title track of that album right here. Going out for Tom, Eleanor, and Allie up in Coburg, Ontario. Winter's on the way and the cold wind's starting to blow Creeping through the cracks in my window, knocking on my door I lay awake wondering if tomorrow's gonna be any brighter But the weatherman says I better throw another log on the fire I spent nearly all of my life running around in the sunshine now I look around and I see nothing but clouds in the sky So I throw another blanket on the bed and dream of distant horizons And let that warm wind blow as I close my eyes I hear the desert and the ocean and the islands all calling out to me Screaming out my name like long lost family Calling me home on a cold, dark night Son of the sunshine A child of the free and distant winds that blow Baptized in the waters off the coast of Mexico And I know I'll be already gone Once the forecast calls for rain And I know I'll be heading down that highway once again Leaving all the clouds behind Straight for the borderline Sound of the sunshine Could it be the force of gravity That's taking a hold of me Pulling me back down to where I know I should be Calling me home on a cold dark night Son of the sunshine A child of the free and distant winds that blow Baptized in the 
waters off the coast of Mexico And I know I'll be already gone once the forecast calls for rain And I know I'll be heading down that highway once again Leaving all the clouds behind Straight for the borderline Son of the sunshine that Thank you very much. Thank you, Tom, for tuning in, man. You've been there every week. We're coming up on 100 episodes, and, and you've been there for all of them. You've got to be sick of me, Tom. So thank you so much. Sammy Rainwater, you've got a request, too. Your fans are watching tonight, so uh, hop on up here and play us something. Hope everybody is enjoying having uh, Sam join us here on Mulligan's Island. And while he's getting set up here, just so you know, um, I'm going to try to do a show next week. we got a couple things that are up in the air, but I'll be able to let you guys know in the next 48 hours or so if we're going to do one next week. But uh, So stay tuned for that, okay? Uh, if you're in San Carlos, I'll be doing a show tomorrow um, at a place called Mercado. You guys know that right now La Palapa Griega is not open yet. We had the big fire. But it's been fun getting over to Medicado. It's a neat, neat place. Three restaurants in one. If you haven't been there, try this place out. Good food. Really good food and uh, neat experience. And I'll be on the outdoor patio starting at 6 o'clock. Uh, recommend you stop by and, and uh, make a reservation if you'd like to get a nice seat on the, on the uh, patio. Okay. Sammy, play us something. Well, see, uh, Patty Duncan uh, requested this song. Hi, Patty. And, uh, Patty, it's good to hear from you. Haven't seen you in a while. And I'm sure we will. And hope uh, medically, uh, the hip's coming along good. I think it was it a knee. It was a hip or a knee. I can't remember. <laughs> well, I hope you're doing good anyway. And here's for everybody who's enjoying life right now. Sitting here by the ocean. Paradise by the sea It's so nice this life I'm living It's so nice lucky me A lucky me Oh lucky me Living by the sea Lucky me, oh lucky me I'm lucky that I live here Sitting here, I often wonder I wonder at the beauty of the day Wonder at the beauties by the water Wonder how my life turned out this way The saying goes that you make your own luck I know most times that's true But once in a while you just get lucky Like that lucky day when I found you Folks come down for their week's vacation They bring their dogs and families Wish that they could stay a little longer They come down, wish they could stay like me 
So I think I'll just stay here by the ocean Spend my life doing pretty much as I please Spend my days feeling lucky Spend my time by the sea Oh, lucky me Oh, lucky me Living by the sea Oh, lucky me Oh, lucky me I'm lucky that I live here With you by the sea Lucky me Lucky all of us yeah, I agree. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Amen. Patty Duncan, hope you hope you enjoyed that. So Sam, as many of you guys know, has has been an active participant in Castaway Kids. Elizabeth too, his wife, and so many of you people watching this show. Um, well, one thing that really helps out Castaway Kids a lot is this thrift shop that we got going in San Carlos. And uh, I thought I would take you guys over there since Sam is involved in this thing. It'd be a nice night to show you the Castaway Kids thrift shop. Let's head over there right now and see what these guys do. In San Carlos, a lot of really cool things happen in this building right here. Run by the Castaway Kids, they've got activities for kids upstairs, like music classes, language classes, and more. Downstairs, they operate a thrift shop that helps raise money for the cause. That's where we're going to take you today, the Castaway Kids Thrift Shop. I want to introduce you to a friend of mine. This is Melissa, and she has worked at Castaway Kids for a long time now. How, how long have you been, been a volunteer a here? Let's see. When did they open the thrift shop? Maybe eight years ago? Yeah. But it's a wonderful uh, place to make a donation that goes to a good cause. A Estudiante Adelante. It helps support the kids in school. It helps support family in need. Um, and you'll find a lot of treasures here. It changes every day from donations. We're open Thursdays and Saturdays currently from 9 till 12. And uh, we have all kinds of things. Electronics, clothing, things for children, toys, jewelry, uh, cameras, snorkels, golf clubs, anything you can imagine. You guys got it all. Bikes. We've got it all. This place kicks butt on Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> and we're under Walmart prices. Uh, yeah. We, we put a whole new meaning to the blue light special. <laughs> Very good. So come on in, make yep. a donation, help us out, help the kids. Yeah. I got to, I get to. And this is Christiane back here. She's working the register today and making lots of money for Castaway <laughs> Kids. Hi, everybody. that's really cool is how different people get involved in helping Castaway Kids. Lorena Robles, one of our local singers here, she donates her music to at Castaway Kids. Uh, this is a beautiful photo book from a local resident, Kathy Henkel, and she took all the pictures, tells great stories about San Carlos, and uh, donates the, all the proceeds from the sales of these things to Castaway Kids. Even my friend Dave Bug up in California, he makes awesome barbecue sauce. My kids love this stuff. And he brings it to Castaway Kids. They sell it right here at the thrift shop. 100% of the proceeds go to Castaway Kids. The coolest thing happened here at the thrift store the other day. A girl came in uh, and saw that we had wedding dresses. We were donated these probably two years ago. And we kept them in the back room so they don't get dirty, etc. And she said, do you sell these? And I said, well, we try to. So she came in for a fitting yesterday and she bought a wedding dress and it was so beautiful. She was standing there in front of the mirror with the dress on and she got teary and she said, 
I never thought I'd be able to afford such a beautiful wedding dress. She's getting married in May in one of our dresses. It was awesome. It made me want to cry. And then I, I was closing up the store after her fitting, and I saw her walking with her dress. So I was like, no, no, get in the car. I'm going to take you home with your new wedding dress. So I did. It's perfect. It's wonderful working here. So, Christian, if somebody wanted to make a donation to Castaway Kids, how do they go about doing that? Sure. I'm here at the office upstairs in the building, Wednesdays and Thursdays, 9 to 3. Uh -huh. So, I'll be happy to help you with donations. You can also uh, stop by and donate things on Saturdays, 9 to 12. Okay. Also, if you would like to make a uh, cash donation, or well, you can do it by uh, online, uh -huh. going to our webpage. Yeah. That is uh, www.castawaykidsmx.org. Uh -huh. CastawayKidsMX.org. Yes. Okay. I got to. I get to. You look so good. I gotta buy a hat. Christian, bring it up. Thank you. Get in here and get some stuff, guys. It's a great cost. A big thank you to all those Castaway Kids volunteers who man that place, who help raise money. For the Castaway Kids, even even you guys who shop there, who donate items, what a cool organization, Castaway Kids. You guys have all in this community really taken that thing to the next level. So many cool charities in this town, and Castaway Kids is just one of them. Well, speaking of gratitude here, uh, this is a song that my friend Mike and Jamie, uh, they are watching us right now, I believe, from Thornton, Colorado, and they're on their way to Lake McConaughey, Nebraska, very soon. Uh, but they'd like to hear this next song. And uh, it's off my Rising Sun, which is kind of a gospel-flavored album that I did for charity. And I uh, always enjoy playing this one. haven't done this one in a while. Maggie Murray, if you're watching, I know this is one of your favorites, too. Um, this one's just called Thank You, God. What a comment. Remember that time I got down on my knees. Begging you please to lend a hand I was amazed when it all turned out okay And me, I just went on my way and that was that I'm not sure that I took the time that day Or if I ever did say Thank you God So I think I'll tell you now Thank you God Gonna say it right out loud, looking back I should have shown more gratitude And I hope it's not too late, thank you God In so many struggles you've gone to bat for me Even when I couldn't see that you were there Whenever I lost hope and I had nowhere to turn And it looked like I just didn't have a prayer Things would turn around but how quickly I'd forget When I should have gotten back down on my knees To thank you God How did I take you for granted? Thank you God How did I not understand it was you? Behind the scenes, calling the shots And I just thought I ought to thank you, God Now this song is gonna serve as my reminder to tell you each and every single day Thank you God For blessing me with all I have Thank you God You're giving me more than I could ask Even now As I bow my head to pray What can I say but thank you God For all the good things that you've done Thank you God the Father and the Son I won't let 
even one more day go by without taking the time to thank you God again and again thank you God all I can say is thank you God Not for Mike and Jamie. Thank you, Mike and Jamie. Hey, my friend Marco. He always calls me Tokayo, that which means we have the same name. Marco, I hope you in January, uh, his girlfriend, are doing well. I think you guys are up in Phoenix right now. But uh, boy, you you came out of the archives with this one. Tom Copeland would be very proud of you. Um, this is a song that actually shows up in two different forms uh, on on different albums. It was originally off my first album that I did, which I think was 1991, a home project called The Things I Love. I wrote a song called Waiting For You. And years later, when I married my wife Adela, my first wife, um, I, I rewrote this song um, into a Spanish version. And it was called Esperado Tu Amor. And it was on an album that's now out of print called Going Coastal. Well, I've kind of adapted that song these days to incorporate both those. And I'd like to play this version of it for Marco. Marco, I'm glad this song means something to you. Uh, and it's called Esperado Tu Amor. I've waited for your love. Pura cámara sería. Listen. That's the sound of your heart beating in the night. You feel the same way I do But no I don't have to say a word You know just what I'm thinking Even after all this time You still read my mind And I've been waiting for you Through a million lonely nights I've been waiting for you Something in my heart kept me holding on But somehow I must have known Cause I've been waiting for you Un sueño Eres tú todo un sueño Como una ilusión Cada secreto escondido en mi corazón Dame una noche sin fin, solo tú y yo, perdidos en las sombras del amor. He esperado tu amor, desde siempre he esperado tu amor. El momento en que llegarás But somehow I must know He esperado tu amor Listen that's the sound of your heart beating in the night And it's telling me you feel the same way I do I've been waiting for you Through a million lonely nights I've been waiting for you Wondering, would you still be holding on? But somehow I must have known Cause I've been waiting for you He esperado tu amor Desde siempre he esperado tu amor Anticipando el momento en que llegarás Y por fin aquí estás He esperado tu amor I've been waiting for you He esperado 
tu amor Thank you very much. I appreciate Marco, thank you, man, for that request. Uh, I'm waiting for you, Esperado tu amor. Going back in the archives on that one for you. And I always appreciate you, Marco, showing up to my shows like you do. January, hello to you. What a cool name. I like that name. Um, Sammy Rainwater, welcome back. In fact, I was going to see if you could join me on a song. You got it. Is that cool? And you, yeah. have, a, you have a request coming up to yourself. Yeah. Um, well, let's... Marcy Tribblehorn, our friend out in San Carlos, is yeah. watching us. And she was supposed to be in our studio audience tonight, but her knee is kind of hurting. We're going to do this in E. Okay. Oh, no, I'm sorry, now. F. F3, okay. So anyway, uh, Kelly McGuire wrote this next song, and he was nice enough to let me record this one. And it sounds like a whole bunch of my San Carlos friends, when this time of year rolls around, and, you know, things are still beautiful here, but it's, you know, time for some of them to head north. And they, they start getting close to Nogales and they already want to turn around and run. I know Sam Rainwater gets that urge. We have one of Kelly's signs on our uh, condo. Turn around and run to the beach. From a weekend paradise I got used to holding you close every night. As we come down from the clouds and touch the ground squeezing my hands so tight but a paradise is behind us where we learned less is really more and all we needed was each other then what are we coming back for let's do it guys let's turn around and run back to the sea and the sun don't need much to have fun just some lotion and some rum We could snorkel for free Or make love on the beach Lay around in the sun Smartest thing we've ever done Let's turn around and run This big old city so full of people Buzzing around like flies All stressed out in their everyday world suits and their ties trying to achieve the next level with a bonus they can buy that new car or a big house just to keep the family they think those things are who they are let's turn around and run back to the sea and the sun don't need much to have fun just some lotion and some rum we could snorkel for free Or make love on the beach Lay around in the sun the Smartest thing we've ever done Let's turn around and run You guys know this part now La 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 Sam wrote this part of the song La 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 We were suffering from a delusion We could leave all this behind No choice but collect our baggage Get ready for that nine to five grind As we mugged our way to the exit I could see the question in her eyes So I answered with a smile Grabbed her hand Next plane back to paradise right on. Let's turn around Back to that Mexico sun Don't need much to have fun Just some lotion and some rum We could snorkel for free Or make love on the beach Lay around in the sun Smartest thing we've ever done Let's turn around and one more time Let's run Let's turn around and run Back to the sea and the sun Don't need much to have fun Just some lotion and some rum We could snorkel for free Or make love on the beach 
Lay around in the sun Smartest thing we've ever done Let's turn around and run Lay around in the sun Smartest thing we've ever done Let's turn around and run Now that sounds like a game plan. Any of you guys thinking about skipping my gig tomorrow at Mercado and going north on us, listen to that song ten times in a row, and then I'll see you tomorrow at Mercado at 6 p.m. That's right. Sam Rainbar, do you have a request for a song yeah, here? Yeah, uh, Cheryl and Bill. Hi, guys up there, way up there in the yeah. frozen tundra. I hope it's warming up a little bit. We're getting hurricanes down here. Our friend, My friends uh, George and Pam, they're down in uh, yeah. Part Escondido, and they're right in the middle of that. It uh, came, came aground a little bit north of where they were, but it's probably they're having a, a hurricane party. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, wow. So, so, so. Cheaper Than Ice is the name of the song. And just uh, for, for you may not have heard it, the, uh, the story behind the song is me and Elizabeth were down in the uh, Caribbean, and uh, we were on um, Montserrat. And Montserrat's favorite because it's where the volcano is that Jimmy Buffett wrote about, and Keith Sykes wrote with it. But anyway, uh, so we were at a beach bar, and the, beach, uh, and the bartender, after a while talking to him, he comped us a drink, comped me a drink, and he went and made it. It was rum and Coke, but it was pure rum with one splash of Coke and one ice cube. And so I asked him why he made that drink that way, and he, this is kind of the story I got from I took a trip down Island Way, south I did go. To that hour where nobody knew where to go when the volcano blow. Went to the bar for a rum and coke, I asked for it very nice. But when the drink came back, it tasted like pure rum, only one cube of ice. So I said, hey man, what kind of drink is that? strong and needs more ice he said you know it may sound crazy but you know you be right you see down here the economy is different you soon know why because the rum is cheaper than coca-cola the coke is cheaper than ice yes the rum is cheaper than coca-cola the coke is cheaper than ice if you want more Coca-Cola, that's a double, I'll charge you twice. If you want to drink it nice and cold, you know, ice is market price. Because the rum is cheaper than Coca-Cola, the Coke is cheaper than ice. He told me why this is so, to hear it's a long, long way. Things you catch, things you grow, they're cheap. It's the island way But if you need to bring it here Or lose electricity You know that costs much more We don't do that much Would you buy a cold drink for me? Cause the rum is cheaper than the Coca-Cola The Coke is cheaper than ice If you want more Coca-Cola That's a double I'll charge you twice if you want to drink it nice and cold, you know, ice is market price. Cause the rum is cheaper than Coca-Cola, the Coke is cheaper than ice. Sometimes things are worth it, sometimes they are not. Sometimes you be thirsty, sometimes you're just hot. Sometimes you have cocktail your way down here we drink our rum straight it's much cheaper that way how about Mark Mulligan over there when you come down island way things are different in many a way the salty breeze the sky of blue the friendly people who welcome you just remember this my friends he 
need my advice. Don't worry about rum. We got lots of that here. Bring your own Coke and ice. Because the rum is cheaper than the Coca-Cola. The Coke is cheaper than ice. If you want more Coca-Cola, that's a double I'll charge you twice. If you want to drink it nice and cold, you know, ice at market price. Cause the rum is cheaper than Coca-Cola, the Coke is cheaper than ice. Don't worry about rum, we got lots of that here. But bring your own Coke and ice. Yeah, I like that. Very valuable information. True, true story, man. We experienced it when we were down in uh, <laughs> we were down in the BVIs, and we experienced it. it was eight, ten dollars for a bag of ice. Wow, so that's good to know in advance, folks. All right, shot of rum, two dollars. <laughs> well, we got time for just a couple more here, but I want to get this next one in for uh, for my buddy John Stalter. John, I've been thinking about you lately. Yeah, you and Pam, you guys are such wonderful, wonderful people. Know you're going through some tough times right now, but I'd like to send this one out for you by request, and I hope this lifts your spirits a little bit. I hope you'll sing along uh, from wherever you guys happen to be right now. Um, you know, we we usually keep it the just originals on, on the show because when you get to a certain viewership level, they actually will cut you off for doing uh, uh, cover songs. I hope that doesn't happen here. If it does, good night, everybody. <laughs> yeah. But I want to do this one for John. And Mark Zuckerberg, please let me sing him this song. Don't be a jerk about this, Mark. Okay? We'll talk later, Mark. I'll pay you off or something. <laughs> Your Mark needs the money. Going out for John Stalter. Somewhere over the rainbow, way up high, birds fly over the rainbow. One day I wish upon a star, wake up with my worries far behind me. Where troubles melt like lemon drops, high above the chimney tops, that's where you'll find me. Oh, somewhere over the rainbow, skies are you dare to dream really do come true One day I'll wish upon a star Wake up with my worries far behind me Where troubles smell like lemon drops High above the chimney tops That's where you'll find me Oh, somewhere over the rainbow Skies are blue Sing along with us, all right? Oh, somewhere over the rainbow, skies are blue, and the dreams that you dare to dream 
really do come true. Hey, John, that one goes out for you and Pam. Wishing you guys the best, and I'm looking forward to talking with you very soon. Hope everyone's had a nice time. I'm going to have Sam do another song for us here. And I want to let you know real, real quickly, um, upcoming shows, we got not only Mercado and San Carlos tomorrow, but I'm going to Rocky Point. You guys watching me there from Margarita Mermaids. I'm going to be there making noise this Saturday. And it's actually, I might want to borrow your ukulele because it's a, it's a Hawaiian-themed luau kind of thing where they're going to have a, this special sweet and sour chicken over coconut rice. It sounds really, really good. Yeah. They're going to be yeah. given away to the folks who come up, the, the best-dressed Hawaiian folks, uh, Hawaiian shirts or, or whatever. Uh, you dress the part, and you have a chance to win a raffle ticket. They're going to give away 10, 15, whatever, of, of great Hawaiian drinks. And uh, it's going to be fun. They're going to slap a lay on everyone when they come, come in. That's going to start at 5 o'clock Saturday night in Rocky Point at Margarita Mermaids, and we're filling up, but we still got room for a few more people if you'd like to join us. Also want to let you know we got Tucson, Arizona coming up June 22nd, 49er Country Club. June 25th, I'll be in Arizona's Cool Country in Pine Top, Arizona. Open to the public, all these shows. And then, of course, in July, I'll be in Colorado, Idaho, Oregon, and Washington. And then in September, I'll be getting over to Reno, Nevada, and then bouncing over to Texas and doing some shows in San Antonio and Port Aransas and still booking dates as we go. So if you want to get the information for any of those shows, go to my website, markmulligan.net. All the info is there for all those shows. Sure would love to see you. And if you want to bring some friends, that's always really cool too. Other thing I want to mention is if you do want to, uh, the new CD is out, Lupita's Taco Stand. And my trick has been for the last five weeks, Rudy B., my mailing agent, has been out of town. But I've got somebody going north uh, to the border, I believe, this week. So if you do want to order one of the CDs, you can use that Venmo or PayPal link right there. And, uh, and I'll make sure to get it in your hands uh, with the next person going north, uh, either on CD or on USB flash drive. Sam also has CDs and flash drives, I believe, too. Sam, tell us about your stuff. You can buy stuff on my website, samrainwater.com. And Sam L. That, Rainwater, right? Well, both actually. Oh, Sam L. Rainwater and Sam Rainwater. Okay. New one. Good. Yeah, I actually splurges the extra twenty dollars a year or whatever it was to get the other domain. Very so. cool. <laughs> and, and Sam, I want to let you guys know he didn't he didn't mention this to you guys, but everything he makes on these CDs, he's been donating to charity, two charities, Soldiers Overseas and Castaway Kids here in Mexico. How much have you raised with your albums and your music, your live performances so far, Sammy? I, I like it better when I state it in pesos. Over $4 million in pesos. 4 million pesos, Four million which is pesos how much? Are. About 200000 a little Two, over 200000 $200,000, <laughs> folks. Isn't yeah. that cool? It's been fun doing it. It's just a change, you know, thanks to Mark for starting me doing music and all of that, and it's uh, really worked out pretty good. Yeah. Thank you so much for letting me be here tonight. You got it, Sammy. I'll tell you what. How about how about if you close our show out here? Let's let's have him do that. I want to thank all you guys for joining us for keeping me in business. Thanks for all your tips because your tips and your viewership is what's kept this show going. We got to count, but I think we're up to ninety nine episodes now. So uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna count that tonight and let you know on Facebook. Thank thank you to Sam Rainwater for joining us tonight. Give him a big round of applause. Thank you all very very much for listening. Okay? Yeah, really appreciate it. Really do. Yeah. All right, Sammy. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to do, um, so uh, this is for Chris and Mary, who are off down somewhere in Mexico. I need insurance for the boat, Mary. Okay, anyway, I got that over with. <laughs> He's taking it's, full advantage I, I, of the show. I, I sent her, I, 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 I sent no, Mary a note, because she's in charge of the insurance for the boat, because okay. we're partners in it. And uh, I said, it's burning a hole in my bucket list. <laughs> oh, that sounds like a song. Yeah, right. <laughs> so this is a little uh, polka that I wrote with Chris. You don't hear polkas so much on trop rock shows, but I hope you enjoy it. Anybody from the Midwest probably will. Roll out the boat drinks. Bring us a barrel of rum. Let's have a party. Parrot as we're having fun. Lose all your troubles. 
troubles don't belong here Everybody loves to polka And the parrot heads are here Sing with me now E-I-E-I-E-I-O 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 E-I-E-I-O E-I-E-I-O Hey! I think we need the studio audience behind the bar helping us out on this. Come on, guys. Come on. Get over here. We need you on over here. Come here. Parrot head polka We all love to dance Parrot head polka Buffett, you missed your chance He never wrote one Let's sing and party Parrot heads, lift up your beers Let's all toast the party And the parrot heads are here Sing with me hey roll out the boat drinks bring us a new keg of beer we like to party raise up your glasses and cheer Parrot at Polka, what could be better than this? Everybody loves to polka with a beach front twist. Sing with me, E-I-E-I-E-I-O. 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 One more time, E-I-E-I-E-I-O. E-I-E-I-E-I-O 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 Hey! Everybody! Everybody! Thanks to everybody for being here! <laughs> Great! Thank you everybody for joining us on Mulligan's Island. How about a big round of applause also for Pablo and Anais running our audio and visual tonight. Thank you Luis for running the... Uh, the uh, comments tonight and by the way i'm hoping that next week i can get Luis to do a song with me on ukulele on this show yep so be sure to join us everybody thanks for joining us hasta luego let's make our way down to mexico friends we know white sand warm sun and h2o it's time for us to get back to lay back try a different beer from our favorite six pack this crazy world says come on let's go it's time for the music man Coastal kid with guitar in hand Even bad days are good Here on the island Giving us a place where we can Talk to each other fan to fan Uncharted courses crossing our paths It's our kind of people And our kind of place Down in the tropics It's a Mexican hideaway Life in this old beach town Turns a frown upside down We all be smiling Here on Mulligan's Island It's the right place and the right time To be south of the border again This is the day we get to listen in We don't sing no blues anymore We kick off our shoes at our front door Full of wide-eyed wonder as the waves roll in It's time for the music man A 
coastal kid with guitar in hand. Even bad days are good here on the island. Giving us a place where we can talk to each other fan to fan. Uncharted courses crossing our paths. It's our kind of people and our kind of place down in the tropics, a Mexican hideaway. Life in this old beach town turns a frown upside down. 